So I'm Shelby Steger. Um, I graduated in May 2015, and my degree, I was a double major in communications and journalism. My current position at the H&I Corporation is um, ta MCR, Talent Acquisition Specialist, so ultimately I'm a recruiter here at H&I. Yeah, so I'm actually very thankful that I got my communications degree because I was um, up until about end of my sophomore year, I was a journalism degree. Um, I really thought I wanted to go into the broadcasting side of in the industry. Um, and so then about the beginning of my junior year, I added my communications degree, so I had a double major. I'm, I'm where I am because of that communications degree, um, and I think it's helped me really just, um, you know, learn what I want to do um, since, you know, I kind of got away from that um, TV broadcasting um, passion, and I really had to find, figure out what do I want to do. I want to do communications, but where is that? What is that? Um, and since then, I've been in corporate communications and now HR, and I really think that communications degree is why I've gotten those two jobs and been so successful. Yeah, so I kind of have a funny internship experience, which I feel is funny. Um, so I interned at um, KWQC Channel 6 News, and I think what I learned from it, which some would say this was a good learning experience, but maybe just a not so positive um, feel coming out of that internship. Um, I loved the people I worked with. I made some lifelong friends. I'm getting married this September and I still have people from Channel 6 being invited to my wedding. So it was a great experience, but overall I just found out that broadcasting isn't wasn't my passion, wasn't my calling, but ultimately it was a good experience, but found out truly what I want to do after college. Um, so I really think what Ambrose taught me, um, you know, outside of my major degree was really just how to be involved in the community, um, how to be a good corporate citizen, um, you know, how to be an outstanding citizen that someone wants to ultimately look up to, um, and not just, you know, be a good employee, but also be a good member and um, person outside of the workforce. But when I was looking for a school to go to, I really wanted to find somewhere that was going to feel like home. Um, and when I got on San Ambrose campus, I had been to about five to six other places and I just felt like Ambrose really felt like home to me. Um, and then now that I'm, my degree is over and I spent four years there, I can say it was nothing but home. Some of my best friends are, um, I met at Ambrose, I would say eight of my bridesmaids, six of them are from Ambrose. So um, ultimately I feel like I had one of the best experiences um, that anyone could have and I feel like making that transition from a small high school into a smaller university um, was the perfect tra transition for a small town girl. If I, I would not pick another school if I did it again and I'm not just saying that because you guys are here. Um, I truly did love my Ambrose experience um, and I think that's why maybe you know so many Ambro Ambrosians are successful um, and I think that's what we bring to a workforce like H&I is just um, being involved in the community, open to new ideas, that warm, fuzzy feeling that you know everyone wants to feel when they're at work, and not so much that stuffy, you know, we're at work feeling. Um, so I think that's really what we bring to a corporation this size. Um, and I think you know the more Ambrose people you can get in an organization, the better.